This is a South Dakota DOT video update on the improvements to U.S. Highway 12 and State Highway 73 near Lemon, South Dakota. The final phase of the project is now underway. This will result in the resurfacing of Highway 73 from Lemon south to Hugh Glass Road, which is just south of the Grand River Bridge, and the resurfacing of Highway 12 from the North Dakota border through Lemon to the Corson County line. The construction scheduled this summer calls for work to be completed on Highway 73 first, and then work will be completed on Highway 12. Accommodation will be made for Boss Cowman days to minimize any possible delays or congestion that the road construction may cause. On Highway 73, one half inch of the old asphalt surface has been milled off and will be recycled for use in the new asphalt mix that will be laid down beginning in the first part of June. The remainder of the asphalt has also been picked up, ground up, and processed back to a temporary road surface by this machine, known as a milling machine. The milling machine was followed by road graders which distribute the mix smoothly, followed by wheel carts which compact it down into a temporary drivable road surface. Now underway is a process called full depth reclamation. In this process, the contractor mills up the road surface all the way down to the base course gravel. Following this process, the crews will rework the asphalt and base course in three passes called lifts, where they will create a solid and smooth surface, so then they can apply the final four and one half inch thick asphalt mat. The asphalt will be laid from shoulder to shoulder, turning this one-time roughest stretch of road in the state to a much wider and infinitely smoother road surface to enjoy in the years to come. This will take a bit more than a month, Highway 73 should be complete by the end of June. During the process, traffic will be controlled by flaggers and a pilot car, so you can expect that there will be some delays this summer. Once crews are done on 73, around the first part of July, they will move to Highway 12. The process here will be less complex and should go a bit faster as long as the weather cooperates. Again, when work begins on Highway 12, flaggers and pilot cars will control traffic through work zones. And keep in mind that the new paving will be coming through town, so stay safe when that time comes. All work is expected to be done by the end of August. After the spring runoff, there were a few places in the ditches where erosion has taken place. This happened due to the late seeding last fall and the grass did not have a chance to take root enough to hold the soil. Last year's contractor is returning now to repair and reseed these areas. There will be an 11 foot width restriction on Highway 73, but the contractor stated that they will work with the locals who have large equipment they need to move from field to field as they did last year. The prime contractor for this project is Anderson Western Incorporated out of Bismarck. If for some reason you need to get into contact with them to let them know you are moving some large equipment or for emergency situations such as ambulance or fire, the following are the contact numbers. We will have a progress report later this summer or as needed. Thank you for watching.